Hello fellow gamers and I'm playing Fortnite Save the World and I'm going to be doing another one of my hero loadout videos. This time it is my third hero loadout and it is for uh, my constructor. Uh, the constructor I have slotted as my main hero is Heavy Base Kyle. Uh, his hero abilities are Decoy, Rosie and Bull Rush, and his uh, perk is Field the Base. Eliminating enemies standing on structures affected by base, charges base. After 30 charges, base emits an explosion which knocks back enemies and deals 89 base energy damage in a 5 tile radius. I'm sure that used to be 3 tile radius. Uh, maybe it's because I've got extra constructor slide, I don't know. Um, his team perk is supercharged traps. So uh, for each constructor, it increases damage of traps affected by base by 8.5%. And I've got four constructors. So that does a, a fair bit uh, more damage. In my first uh, support team slot, I have, of course, Survivalist Jonesy. Eliminations heal you for 39 base health over three seconds. Duration refreshes with additional eliminations. And of course, he's uh, level 130. In my second support team slot, I have Frozen Castle. Enemies standing on structures affected by base are snared by 15%. And for that, you need the Ice King and he's level 130 as well. In my third support team slot, I have Power Modulation. Structures affected by base are healed for 4% of max health every 10 seconds. And for that, you need power base knocks. And again, he's level 130. In my fourth support team slot, I have electrified floors. Enemies standing on structures affected by base take 12.7 base energy damage every 5 seconds. And for that, you need Thunder Thora. And she's at level 130 as well. And in the final fifth support team slot, I have Mega Base. Increases base connectivity range by one. And you need Mega Base Kyle to have that team perk. And he's level 130 as well. And as always, gadgets, stationary hover turret and adrenaline rush. So uh, let's uh, go and do a mission. I've decided to choose a, a fight the two category storm <laughs> just in I didn't really want to go for a four in case they were like too far apart and we've got somebody joined us as well which is good because I probably couldn't have done it solo <laughs> I don't normally play as a constructor I normally use a um, soldier or a ninja. The only time I sort of tend to play as a constructor is when I'm doing um, storm shield defences. So it's going to be a bit strange having to to build to get up to to things to rather than uh, triple jumping or double jumping. I did just start recording a video, it was a 4 Atlas one, and um, I put um, Storm Chest in the, the team chat uh, three times, and um, when I started, I gave the guy time to come over, uh, he didn't, I started the Storm Chest, and uh, he left the game, so, let's see if this guy comes over, I just crafted a 130, uh, Pain train as well. Not used one of these for a while. What's he doing? Clear out some of this stuff around it. It'll make it easier. I 
can't be searching them really but hey ho Some efficient out of that. Apparently, epic of um, increase the amount of uh, sunbeam and bright core you get now. Constructors as well. Never get between a lady and her tools. Check that out a second one. Hmm. Wow, these enemies are. Uh, have they made storm chests harder? Down again. some sunbeam out of that shadow shard and obsidian um, need to drop some in there so I can recycle it I don't think I need that do I nah I'm not gonna Might as well pick it up though. Always drop it for someone if they want it. Right, let's go find some yeah, not possible. blue glow. one over there just need one more now there's one over here Someone's following me, I can hear him. Oh, sorry. Right, let's go try and find the atlases now. An extra loop over there. Sorry love, I haven't got time. Hey, I've rescued my uh, 10,000 survivors anyway now, so... Not like 
I uh, actually need them. Target located. Drop the atlas on the target when you're ready. Someone's found it. So that's inside. No, it isn't. It's in quite an awkward position now. I have to clear out everything around it. And this guy wants to trade. Sorry. That's the last one. Just made the world safer. Nice work. Add blue glow to the atlas. Open mission control when you're ready to begin. Cracked a little bit of ammo. I'm not trading with you, so don't bother gun boxing me in. I hate it when people do that. Just think because you're going to trade with them just because they box you in. Well, tough. I'm not trading. See, I'm not the fastest of builders. <laughs> How far apart are these? Mm, wonder if my base is actually going to cover both atlases. Mind you, we have another constructor anyway, so... So if my base doesn't cover both of them, their base will cover one of them and mine will cover the other one. Let's upgrade all this. fairly close together. Might be alright then. Uh, um, let's stick some traps down. Shame that there's a building in between both of the atlases. I 
Wish I could uh Shame I didn't have an Outlander. Could have cleared this uh, this slot pretty quick. That one. Let's stick down some of these. Is that going to cover both? Yes. Nice. course we have the electrified floor so any enemy standing on these will uh, will take damage destroy that otherwise the uh, any husks going down there will be able to get back out again to leave that actually because it will protect it from lobbers wouldn't it I probably should really shouldn't I uh, it's only it's only um, base is only going up to here it's not um, protecting these bits here I'm wondering if I should move it across one tile or not. Nah, I'll leave it where it is. Waiting. <clears throat> I'll clear out these bits here. I always like to clear out things around an atlas. It just it makes it a bit easier. When you're trying to shoot things. But on the other hand, it also slows enemies down. Well, they have to go around it. Uh, 
this one still across the other side. Oh, they've started it. It's not a four-player one, was it? It's just a normal. Yeah, it's just a normal. from this side as well. That other guy still across there? Yeah, not helping with the mission. I'm not keen at those shielded. Um, enemies because the only way you can normally take them down is either by shooting for that little ice slot or um, from behind This is the first time I've used a, a 130 uh, paint train. I've used a, I think it was a 106, but uh... oh, I haven't got a have a turret. <laughs> you see when I'm glowing, glowing green. That's where I'm get where I'm getting um, health from the uh, survivalist perk. These other blokes. I'm going to go down here in a minute, I think. Oh, my teammate was down.
took out that propane, we don't want him over here. It's left. The propane. Yeah, not possible. Coming from this direction now. Check out the turret. sneak up from no nope. do you dare propanes oh. six seconds I think we've got this We could see he wasn't doing uh, much there. The guy that was farming while the mission was uh, going on. But we did it. reward I think it was double schematic XP I don't sort of really need any survivor XP I think I've got over 65 million of it it's a shame you can't actually convert one one um, type of XP into another like you can convert like 10 million of survivor XP into hero XP or into into uh, schematic XP I will survive XP for that one, 285,000. Well, thank you for watching. Don't forget to smash that like button. If you're new to my channel, then why not subscribe? Hit the bell notification symbol and you'll be notified when I publish new videos on YouTube. If you'd like to help out my channel, you can do so by sharing my videos on social media, on Facebook, Instagram, etc. Tell all your gaming friends about my channel and help my channel to grow. 
Um, if you'd like to help out my channel a little bit financially, I do have a Patreon account and you can pledge from just $1 a month. And there's a link to my Patreon in the description of all of my YouTube videos. If you are under the age of 18, please ask your parents permission before pledging. That's all I ask. Many thanks for watching. And we shall see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye for now.